so good morning guys this is true with jim and today we will be addressing one of the common problems which the android users face the internal storage problem so let's start with it first of all you will be needing these two things uh sorry the java sdk uh, i have provided the link in the description so based upon your computer system if it is 64 bit download that following accept it and start the download and as far as android sdk is concerned click on download android studio go to configure and sdk manager so after you have done both the things open the android sdk folder and click on SDK manager and the following window will be opened and from the following list you just need to install these two things uh, which I have already installed and nothing of this sort and google usb driver install again so I am not having the install option but you guys will be having that then go to SDK folder platform tools and right click no actually shift plus right click so this will open the command prompt uh, to the current location and yeah I, I forgot to tell you that you need to connect your android device in the usb debugging mode which can be enabled through settings this is my android device sony xperia l now let's get back to command prompt and type the following command adb devices and press enter this will show the connected android devices then type the following command and press enter so this command basically shows the default install location which is 0 means auto 1 means internal and 2 means external so we have to set the location to external so do the following and press enter again and this is what we have the command has been executed so let's cross check it get install location and as you can see the install location has been changed which is to external alright so hope this thing works for you just restart your phone and try installing an app and hope it works and earlier it was much easier to install the ADT bundle that is the Android SDK pack but now you need to download the Android studio and all I don't know how it works but in case if you're not getting this folder you can always search over your platform tools and yeah this will open the required directory so that's it guys, hope it works for you, thanks a lot for watching.